We are students from University Malaysia Pahang would like to do a project regarding AutoCAD from course BMM1553 Dynamics. Dynamical systems have a lot of interesting structure and dynamic establish a body of information that can accurately uh, predict the behavior of many of these systems. So the special features for AutoGate so need to uh, increase in recent time used to remote a control convenience, the technology used to eliminate dates, monitoring and meaning by human beings. Theory of Relative Motion Analysis Relative Motion Analysis is a method of involving two sets of coordinate axes which is used to analyze two components' motion separately. The two components are the combination of translation and rotation of an undergoing general planar motion. When every line segment on a body remains parallel to its original direction during the motion, translation will occur. In a general plane motion, translation occurs within a plane and rotation occurs about an axis perpendicular to this plane. The following are the formula that involve in relative motion analysis. Thank you. Before moving into calculation, let's watch the video of the AutoGate opening. A warm welcome everyone. My name is Shatish son of Ramu. Metric number is MA20015. I'm here to explain the manual calculation of the velocity of an AutoGate regarding relative motion analysis. Here we have to find the average velocity of point A. <clears throat> so from the video, I know that A to O is 14 seconds and the distance from A to O is 1.5 meter. So we have the displacement and we have the time. We can find the average velocity which is 0 0.107 meter per second. From the average velocity, we have to find the velocity of M which is the midpoint of panel A, B <coughs> using IC when the theta is 30. So the IC is perpendicular line of velocity A and velocity B. So the IC is here. Using the formula, we can find the omega which is 0 0.143 radian per second. A, B and A, M share the, share the same omega. <coughs> so we can find the B, M which is 0 0.09 meter per second. The omega rotates anti-clockwise. Same goes to here using vector method. So using this formula, <coughs> I can find my omega AB which is 0 0.143 and velocity of B, same with velocity of A. And using the omega, I can find my VM using this formula. And finally, my VM is 0 0.09 meter per second, same with the IC. Now I use Scala method to find the velocity of M. We have VA here. We have to find VAB. So using this method, VAB is 0 0.06 meter per second. Using VAB and VA, we can find velocity of M, which is 0 0.09 meter per second. All the methods shows the same velocity, which is 0 0.09 meter per second. Thank you. Hello, my name is Riknesh and I'll be explaining to you about our program. Our program is only made for our gate. So to start, you have to run the program and it asks us the degree, the theta of AB. So we enter the value of 30. And then the theta of OB. So we enter the value of 40. As you can see, our input and our calculations are, are all here. And this is the angular velocity that we got. So to create the graph, you have to copy paste these values in Microsoft Excel. So this is how it will look and Excel will automatically plot the graph for us. Thank you. Let's start to our discussion. Relative motion analysis is one method used to analyze bodies undergoing general planar motion. General planar motion is motion where bodies can uh, both translate and rotate at the same time. So this is the example figure that we choose. The first step in relative motion analysis is to break uh, the motion down into simple steps and assign a coordinate system to each step in the change of motion. So we know that uh, this is uh, the formula for velocity and acceleration. So the above equation is vector equation. So these velocities have uh, both magnitude and a direction. Conclusion. 
Based on the movement of the autogate, we figured out that the panel will be rotating about a fixed axis that passes through point O with angular velocity of OB. Panel BA is in a general plane motion which is a combination of translation and rotation with angular velocity of BA. Based on the calculation, the angular velocity of panel AB and OB are the same. Besides that, by analyzing the kinematic of a folded autogate system, we found out the relationship between angular velocity and speed. Furthermore, this analysis also shows that the greater the rotation angle in a given amount of time, the greater the angular velocity. Thank you.